Hey, Sammy, how's your St. Patrick's Day going? Well, it's going great. I'm just sitting here trying to sober up a... Uh, that's a big glass you have there. You're right about that. I'm going to try some of this light vodka that we have sitting on the counter. Now, before you worry too much, I did read the alcohol level on it, and it's pretty minimal. And I'll only take sips of it, so... Be careful, Mary. You know what alcohol does to your body when you overdrink. Oh, Sammy, have you got the memo yet? It's St. Patty's Day. I can handle a little booze, and this is one of the few days I drink this heavily anyway. And you know vodka is my favorite type of booze, so I got this. Several drinks later. Oh, I suck drunk, Sammy. Oh no, Mary, you're completely tipsy. This isn't good. I want the green vodka. Give me more. Give me more! How many drinks have you had? Don't worry, Samuel L. Jackson. I only had myself two shots and nothing more. I haven't tried this one yet. Help me out, brother! Really? Because you're acting like you've had more than two shots. What? Well, I'm completely sober. The fuzzy mannequins sitting at the table agree. Am I right? There are no fuzzy mannequins here. You're totally sloshed. You need to lay down a bit. I'm thinking Stripping down my underwear in the hallway. We could bathe in green milk in the lobby and throw leprechauns out the roof of the apartment complex after we're done. We're gonna go crazy, am I right? Be the boy! Oh, no, 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 no. This is not looking good. Not at all. The next day. <sighs> Let me guess. You have a really bad hangover, don't you? My head hurts. I'm so nauseous right now. Well, I tried to get you to stop drinking last night, so this is your consequence, I guess. You're right. Guess I shouldn't have inebriated myself that much. Darn right. There's two vodka bottles on the floor and a mountain of red Solo cups in the kitchen. Ten of them. Uh, I think I'm gonna throw up. Don't worry, Mary. You'll survive this. Uh, uh. Here's the lesson, kids. Don't get too drunk on St. Patrick's Day. In fact, don't get drunk at all. Period. Or you'll end up like me. A red-eyed, miserable, sick beaver with an unsettling migraine on the couch, wishing for a glass of water to whisk this grisly aftermath away.